All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's Bullhammer Gaming. Today we are continuing Dying Light. Power into it, and one, and two. Come on, don't be a wimp. I'm trying. I'm, I'm trying. Yeah, you're just gonna try to bash that zombie's head in, or you're gonna do it. They can save your life. I'm, I'm running errands for Rise. He wields a lot of power, scares a lot of people. Damn right he does. Listen, mate, time's getting short. We're almost out of answers in. And much as I hate to admit it, I'm getting worried. Look, I'm doing the best I can out here, Brecken. I know, I know. I understand. I just want you to be aware of the stakes. I'm infected too, remember? Believe me, I'm motivated. All right, all right. He's hoping you can make it back to the tower soon. You need something? Hey, have you seen that house with the red smoke pouring out of it? If Rise's people spot it, they're gonna come knocking on his door. Someone ought to warn him. Look, I've got enough trouble right now, but I'll think about it. All right, I usually don't go out at night in this game, but you know what, let's try it out. If I die frequently, I'm gonna sleep and wait for a, wait for the day.
bookcase, he said. Okay. All right, night was too short, I guess. <laughs> Feed a couch potatoes guide to vegetable guide. That's the one. A falafel diet. DVD player user manual. Big book of death metal. Simple tricks to get the chicks. Do it yourself a horse head and have a look good over 40. Big butt bonanza. Nice. Wet Dream, the first romance novel for plumbers. Good God. Thousand and one banana recipes. sees everything. Don't forget that. What's the point of the airdrops? Rice takes everything away. There's a lot to be done around the tower. I hope you find some time to- hey, You've got my glasses and the book? Ah, that's great. Good lord, my glasses are filthy. What have you been doing with them? No, 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 never mind. It, it doesn't matter. Here, let me give you something for your trouble. As soon as the crate hits the ground.
All right, next level of skills combat adapt. There's a guy in orange waiting for it. That's for the report the Eastern Substation. And we are going to clear the safe house as well. Now well, let's see if we can make that machete. Correct machete. Nope, still need one alcohol.
the substation. Just find the control panel and turn the switch on. That will reboot the system. Done. Good. Now you've got to do the same thing in the second substation. All right, let's go to the northern substation. In our, in our way there, let's clear this safe house as well. What the hell, man? Ah! 
There's the northern substation. Alfie, two down, one to go. Now, if I remember correctly, I have to go there when it's night. Can't go in during the daytime. So I'm just gonna continue the Rice's quest, the main quest.
Well, this one has a more damage. I just saw something I've never seen before. This huge bloated infected just fucking exploded. Yeah, we call them bombers. The bombers. Some of our guys use them to kill other infected. Shoot them, and they take out everything in a three meter radius. You kidding me? Keep your distance and you'll be fine. But what about the courier? Was he there? No, I didn't I didn't see anybody, just fucking zombies. Alright. You'll have to go to the village directly.
Whoa, <laughs> there are too many runners. Okay, Kareem, I'm outside the village, but there's a whole horde of infected in there. So, clear them out. We get paid for protection. Do some protecting. I gotta get that gate closed before more of those fuckers get inside. Damn asshole. died there. I hate the damn magnetic power of those zombies. If you are anywhere close, they just catch you up. sent me. I'm here for a pickup. Yes? Who, who goes there? I'm here on Rice's behalf. I'm supposed to pick something up. Oh my god. That's one of Rice's men. What do I do? Just tell them to go away. Do it nice and maybe he'll leave us alone. Better yet, send it to Gersel. He'll know what to do. 
Please, we don't know anything. Go, talk to Gersel. He lives above the storm. Hey, anybody in there? Shh, not so loud. You brought the monsters. Look, I got rid of them, but you better reinforce that gate before more show up. You got rid of them? All of them? Rai sent me. You, Gersel? Oh, you were for Rise. Uh, I should have known this was too good to be true. You've taken enough. You can't have any more freaking tell him. Ayla, please. Just let me talk to the man. You can't just push us around like this. Furkin gonna kick your ass. Do it, Furkin. Kick his ass. For God's sake. Look, I don't want any trouble. But we already paid this month. You're gonna bleed us dry. That is entirely not my problem. Rise wants his payment, so you make the payment or things get bad for you. And your woman. You can't threaten us. Kick his ass, Furkin. Give me a break, Isla. All right, fine, here. This is all of it. Ugh. A real man would have kicked his ass. Yeah, I'll leave you to it. Sounds like you have bigger problems than money. Okay, Kareem, I got Gersel's money. I fucking hate myself now, but I got the money. The self-hatred fades eventually. Just one pickup to go. At the ferry station on the old pier. There's a ferry? There was until the Navy sent it to the bottom of the bay. Dozens of people were stranded there, waiting for another one that never came. Are there any boats left? Yes, but any boat that tries to leave the bay gets blown right out of the water. There's that second part of the city. You can see the different architecture that we see from the second part. I don't remember the story correctly but I don't know why we go through sewer or something to go to that area. In a mission we do go beyond that gap over that side of the bridge. So why can't we just take the bridge and go there? I could be wrong though I don't remember much. Any guess how those infected got through the fence? Guess? I know exactly how they got in. That masked nut job soared through the husp. Who are you talking about? They call him Gas Mask Man. He lives outside. He's crazy in the head. So he wears a gas mask all the time. Like it's going to protect him. And you're sure it was him? One of the guards saw him cut the husp and run off. Someone's got to do something about that guy. Well, first we're going to the ferry. Let's search home along the way. We might find some alcohol. What the fuck do you want from me? I 
hate them. Here, take this. You deserve it. Still too far away. Not now. Yep, I have enough components, I guess. Oh, for the love of. Alright, <laughs> Sidey Machete. Up for rise back already we just paid off you blood suckers <sighs> don't shoot the messenger I'm just trying to get by like everybody else yeah so are we rise said he'd protect us if we paid him but so far all he's done is take our money there's no protection just threats you any different look all I want to do is get this over with what's it gonna take huh don't need to point out how easy it would be to set this entire place on fire Jesus Christ, you people are fucking monsters. All my money's in that satchel. Take it and get the fuck out. And for what it's worth, this isn't something I want to do. I'd rather be helping you guys. And yet you're still doing it, aren't you? Okay, Kareem, I made the collection at the ferry station, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to hell. Join the club. Now, come back and claim your prize. Good job today. And later we are gonna help all these people, all three places. 
Not later, as soon as this quest finishes. I'm Neil Fallon. I'm a journalist for International Affairs magazine. Yeah, I've heard of you. You have? How the hell'd you get in here? It wasn't so hard during the first few days of the quarantine. And when they put Suleiman in charge, it was pretty clear how things were going to go. So you decided to stick around? Actually, I've decided to leave. Though God knows how that's gonna happen. I've been in some lockdown cities before, but there's usually someone you can bribe. Not here. I can't get you out of Haran. I'm not sure anyone can. No, of course. But I've been documenting this place, pretty much from day one. I've interviewed hundreds of, well, people who aren't people anymore. Suleiman has a lot to answer for. The world needs to know what's happened and, look, I'm kind of desperate here. I've lost my work, all of it. I was holed up at an internet cafe when a mob of infected landed on me. I got out without a bite, but I left my satchel at the cafe. And everything's in the satchel? Most of it. They chased me for a while, so I finally had to ditch my camera in a car. Look, I know it's a lot to ask. All right, even if I recovered them, you still don't have a way out of here. Mister, if I can't get my work back, there's no reason for me to get out. Now that cafe's in a bad area. I'll... I'll think about it, but no promises, okay? All right, we are on our way to go to Rice. But we're gonna take a different route this time. We clear this safe house, meet the gas mask man, and then in our way, go through here to meet Rice. What's wrong? Someone's turned on the 18th floor. We're doing our best to contain the situation, but... We can't sugarcoat this crane. We need Anderson right fucking now! Rise has promised me two crates, Brecken. Two crates. I'm doing this shit as fast as I can, I swear.
Shakur didn't want visitors, Shakur shouldn't have sabotaged the fence at the fishing camp. What? What are you talking about? That wasn't Shakur, that was Gas Mask Man. You're Gas Mask Man. Me? You're insane. Why would you think that? Because you're wearing a gas mask? But you have been tricked, my friend. This saboteur was an imposter who makes himself to look like me. So you will be angry at Shakur. But Shakur knows who did this. Shakur saw him without his mask. So you're saying you saw someone disguised as you? I watched him from behind the rocks. He did not see Shakur, but Shakur saw him. Well then Shakur better tell me who it is. No. <laughs> My information is far too valuable. If you want to know what Shakur knows, then first you will do a thing for me. Then I will tell you. We're not negotiating, Shakur. Of course not. Shakur tells you what to do, and you must obey. Now, obey Shakur. And what exactly does Shakur want? There's a lake nearby. My treasure bag fell out of the boat and was lost in the water. You must be like a fish and bring it back to me. Go! Be quick! One thing I don't understand is, if zombies drown in the water, why don't they just make a barge type of thing and live in the middle of sea? Only come on land when they need resources. Alright, I've got your bag. Why couldn't you get it for yourself? Shakur can't swim. Now, first the bag. Then, I tell you who is Shakur Imposter. All right. Okay, Shakur, tell me what you saw. First, the Imposter sneaks out of the village. He's very quiet, like a master spy. Then, he puts on a mask. Then, he sneaks back to the gate. But now, he is very noisy, so the guard will see him. Then, he cuts the lock and runs away. Did you recognize him? He looked crazy to me. Nothing like Shakur. But do you know who he was? Of course. He's one of the fishermen, the one who's disguised as Shakur. All right. I'll check it out. By the way, Shakur, what was in the bag? My air. My precious, clean air. Now I can breathe again. Oh no no, Shakur ain't crazy. <laughs> oh 
Of course I have to go all the way back there. Let's just get this over with. <laughs> Dead Island Head Vehicles. I don't know why this game doesn't. How many people have keys to open the gate? Just a few. Tom, Gersel, or Musa. Thanks. Have I got a deal for you? Canadian girl, Katie, always ready to go. She told me to every Typical, right? Five minutes in heaven, two weeks on penicillin. What can I do for you, Crane? You sabotaged the gate, Gersel. You let the infected into the village. Me? He was a crackpot in the mask. The, the guard saw him. Yeah, but someone else saw you. Who? What is he? Show me. Well, there's also the mask I found in your hut. Yeah, well, what was I supposed to do? The village didn't want to pay tribute to Rice, and Rice was getting impatient. That's why he sent you, right? So you allowed an attack on your own people? I had to convince them that they needed Rice's protection. It did the job, didn't it? So what the hell do you care? Now Musa wants to put a bullet in Gas Mask Man. And that's a problem? Yeah, make sure it doesn't happen or you'll be explaining why you allowed Infected into the village. All right, all right, I'll talk to Musa and the guard. All right, Gas Mask Man won't be bothering you anymore. Did you put a bullet in him? No, that wasn't necessary. After what he did? Look, you may not like it, but murdering people is still kind of a big deal. If you decide it isn't, you and me are gonna have some problems. No problems, mister. I just got mad. I never hurt anybody. Thanks for talking to him.
This is a different tunnel. <laughs> what dark area? I don't see any dark area. Dark areas beyond that? But even then the tunnel is really short. How is that a dark area? About halfway back, I guess. Good. I need you to make a quick detour. God. Why? One of our patrols went off the grid somewhere near the market. How is that my problem? I'm making it your problem. See if you can find them, or don't bother coming back. All right. Objective changed, I guess. I think I found your lost patrol. Something ripped them limb from limb. Search the bodies. Look for some blueprints in a small envelope. And don't damage them. They're worth more than all those dead assholes put together. Did you find the envelope? Not yet. Wait a sec. Holy shit!
Okay, I got it. Good. Bring it back to me right away. You're going to be a hero around here. Hey, you! Come over here! I'm on the antenna, do you see me? I'm up here! I need your help! Finding my son, Christoph. You work for Rise, don't you? Sure, for protection. But I can't go to him for a thing like this. My son is... he's young. He thinks with his mouth instead of his head. He doesn't understand that sometimes you've got to go along with people who aren't so good. Now he's run off to join Brecken's bunch at the tower. He thinks he's going to be a runner. It's not the safest line of work. He's going to get himself killed. He's not ready. He's too young to be out there. Shouldn't you be looking for him yourself? You don't understand. I make weapons for eyes. If the new ones aren't ready when his people come, me and Kristoff are both dead. Please, do this for me. I'll give you something good. Something special. Okay? Yeah, maybe I'll ask around at the tower. If I find something, I'll let you know. But if you ask me, your protection seems to have you pretty scared. You should really think about it. Alright, I know it's a night time, what the hell, let's go for it.
Night is coming. It's safe to say that Rice isn't the most popular person in town, huh? No, but he is the most feared. And you know the old saying, it is better to be feared than loved if one cannot be both. Ah, uh, Machiavelli. Correct. Smart fellow, that one. the blueprints. Excellent. You're a lot more dependable than most of these drunks. Rise is waiting for you. Maybe we can work together again sometime. God, I hope not. If you show them compassion, they will see it as weakness. Understand? I give you shelter, I give you bread, women, bullets, and you cannot do it. It's a simple task. I should send every one of you to the pit. Ah, the tower lackey returns. Do you have something for me, friend? Yes, I do. Now it's time for you to give me what you promised. Two crates of Andesin. I think not. Your loyalty to the tower is nothing but blind obedience, Crane. A coward's submission to false hierarchies. You follow their rules as thoughtlessly as you follow mine, like a good little dog. Look, we had a deal. <sighs> Your people need the Anthazine. Now, more than ever, I would surmise. But a man who follows someone else's rules is no man at all. Here, I will allow you this much. You promised me two crates of it. This is only five vials. If you want more, I present you with an opportunity. The athlete, the Scorpion, Jade Aldemir. She's one of your number. Bring her to me. I have an arena where men fight for our amusement. I would have this Scorpion fight for us. I'm curious how long it would take for someone of her caliber to uh, break. What? No. No, forget it. I'm not doing it. I hear no true conviction in your voice, Crane. You have not yet made your choice, I can tell. Will you be a dog and save the dwellers of the tower? Or will you be a man and save the maiden? Go and think about it.
Ah, oh, shit. here. Report. I'm no longer cooperating with Rise. He wanted me to kidnap Jade Aldemir and dump her with him so he can make her fight in his pit. Yes, and? Was that it? What do you mean, was that it? I'm not a fucking human trafficker. You seem to have forgotten how much is riding on this file, Crane. If Rise wants one girl, then give her to him. You'll be there to keep an eye on her, won't you? What the... What the fuck kind of humanitarian outfit are you guys? And for that matter, if this project file can save the world, why keep it a fucking secret? We're not paying you to be insubordinate, Crane. Get this done. Well, fuck you, asshole. All right, let's go to the tower. Any guess what happened? None. And our gas man Jeff up and quit on us last week. He was kind of irreplaceable. Maybe I can track him down. Make maybe, definitely, and get on it fast. Word is he's built up his own little fortress somewhere behind the train station. All right. Survive the night. Last time I played this game, I completely missed the tip that you can use the senses to see where the uh, volatiles are. Brecken, this is Crane. Do you copy? Brecken, do you copy? Shit. Jade, this is Crane. Do you copy? Listen, Rice wanted me to, he was... Look, he screwed us, okay? I only got... What? Damn it! That's only a few days worth. Listen, Crane, we've got a situation here. There's been an outbreak on the 18th floor. Get back here ASAP, and don't lose any of that Anderson.
eyes. Jade just told me there's been an outbreak on the 18th floor. I've got to get what little antis and I have back to the tower pronto. Do you have the antizen? Give it to me. So what happened? One person turned and had a couple of other people trapped. We could have sealed off that one apartment, but Brecken wanted to save as many lives as possible. It went bad. Somebody had to make the call. And now we've lost the entire floor, including, including a couple of kids. You'd better talk to Brecken. I have to get these meds to Lina. Hey, Crane. It's good to see you. What happened here, it's so very sad. All right, first, let me give Dowd a gun. I have a sparrow now. You got it? Great. Here's the key I promised you. It's to my old pawn shop, you know? Used to be the best in town. Hey, speaking of the pawn shop, would you do me another favor? I need you to bring me something from the shop. You're going there anyway, right? What is it? It's a... Don't laugh, okay? It's a Ray McCall action figure. I know it sounds silly, but it means a lot to my son. This is where we get the announcements about the Antisyn drops. And they've just stopped. They will kill this! I froze. Lena had to step up. Maybe she should be in charge. What the fuck, Crane? I'm no leader. I'm a goddamn parkour instructor. Wait, so all the free running. Wait, that was you? Bracken, you showed these people how to survive. Do you know what my pockets were full of when I showed up in Haran? Fucking business cards. I was hoping to drum up some more students. Maybe get enough so I could save up and buy a house. Instead of that poxy little flat I've been renting. Listen. I'm gonna talk to Rice myself. Whoa, whoa, H hang on a minute. Reckon these people still need you. Okay, just, just give me some time, all right? There's, there's gotta be another way. A better way. Fine. I'll wait. But not for long. Finally, I get to do some actual good. Raheem? Raheem, what are you doing up here? Hey, Crane. Can I trust you? <laughs> How much you had to drink, kid? Can I or not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up? See that skyscraper? Scout from the volatile nest in there. We take that out, and then running missions at night, we could totally do that. So I'm thinking, if we planted some explosives, Oh, Jesus. Raheem, you're not still on that. Crane, we have to do this. As long as that nest is there, we'll never be able to gather up enough antis. It would work. We make a good team. Ah! Shit, oh my... Ah! Don't drop me! Don't drop me! Oh, fuck. <laughs> See? Told you we make a good team. Look, Raheem, we don't have any explosives. I mean, none. The closest thing to what you're talking about are Spike's firecrackers. It, it, it's impossible. We don't know what it's like. 
All I can do is watch, sit on my ass, and watch everything happen and do nothing. I don't want to die here, Kryn. Not like this, not helpless. If I go out, I'd rather go out doing something. What's this? I was set to fly out on Sunday. They quarantined us on Thursday. I already had my bags packed. I'll get, look, I'll keep my eyes open, okay? If there's some way we can make this happen. Whatever. This is Crane, do you copy? What do you want, Crane? I want you to start the antizen drops again, at least near the tower. These people need help. We put you in Haran to find our file, not to play Mother Teresa. Or does this mean you've reconsidered Ryza's proposal? Perhaps Miss Aldermere would even be willing to cooperate, test her skills in a new environment. You start giving us some antizen and then... And then we'll talk about what Ryze wants. Oh, it's us now, is it? Well, I'm afraid your request is out of the question in any case. Things have gotten a bit strained with the Ministry. Resuming the airdrops would not be politically advantageous at the moment. Well, you assholes take the fucking cake, you know that? You and your fucking file. Look, I'll locate the file for you, but I'm gonna take a good long look at it before I decide what to do about it. Loud and clear, what can I do for you? I don't know how much time we have, so the short version. I need your help. Rice has turned an abandoned school into a supply dump. And I think it may be where he's storing his antizen. If you and I sneak in there, we could get all the meds the tower needs. Are you with me? Yeah, I'm with you. Great. Look for me in one of the boxcars on the train trestle near the school. Okay, and listen, Jade. If we don't find that Antizen, I'll need to talk to you about something. About what? Another option, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Right now, let's see what we can find in that school. Alright, I was thinking before that that's the tower that we, we go to for a mission. But no, I think it's that one. In the opposite direction. That's the tower we go to for a mission. Alright, we're gonna continue this next time. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, and I will see you next time.